There has been a worldwide outpouring of sympathy for Prince William as members of the public shared their admiration for his dedication to his royal duties, while he honored as the King and Catherine battled cancer. The princess has paid tribute to the support of her husband William, as it emerged he will return to royal duties after spending Easter with his family. The royal revealed the news had come as a huge shock and that she and William have been doing everything we can to process and manage this privately for the sake of our young family. To be remembering how traumatic the experiences were for Prince William, one user commented on X that he lost mother in a tragic accident, lost grandpa and grandpa in the space of two years, and had an estranged, spiteful brother. Now, both his father and wife are battling cancer. Behind him had three young children need to protect and raise. Even our future king is trying to keep the monarchy going. After all, he is the only person who might fully understand what this is like and still keep a brave face in the face of all this. For me personally, I'm amazed at the strength he has shown. Also, I feel so sorry for the prince as the conspiracy theorists and parts of the media in recent days were saying awful lies about him, his wife, and his marriage. A source emphasized that this has been a difficult period for the Wales family. William has been focused on supporting his wife and children while continuing to undertake engagements and work, and is extremely grateful for the support from the public. She said, Having William by my side is a great source of comfort and reassurance too, as is the love, support, and kindness that has been shown by so many of you. It means so much to us both. The Prince of Wales has attended around a dozen royal engagements since pulling out of the memorial service for his godfather, King Constantine of Greece, due to his wife's diagnosis on February 27. Kensington Palace initially said it was because of a personal matter, that kept the Prince of Wales from being there, but it has now been confirmed this was because of the Princess of Wales's cancer diagnosis. He also has been praised for putting on a brave face as he performed his duties including Earthshot Prize meetings and the Diana Legacy Awards in honor of his late mother. He had cleared his diary of official duties to help support Kate's recovery, Aldo did visit a homelessness charities base in Sheffield on Tuesday this week. The couple were seen being driven from Windsor on March 11, although only William attended that afternoon's Commonwealth Day service at Westminster Abbey in central London while his wife continued on to a private appointment elsewhere. Their children Prince George, Princess Charlotte, and Prince Louis all attend Lambrook School which starts its summer term on April 17. It has just 610 boys and girls aged 3 to 13 and is mixed so all three children can attend together cutting down on school runs and security teams. Catherine, William, and their children have their main home as four-bedroom Adelaide Cottage on the Windsor grounds in Berkshire, with no live-in staff although they do have a nanny, housekeeper, and security team living nearby. The Grade 2 listed property is owned by the Crown Estate and the couple are said to be paying market rent. Now they say that Catherine is in good spirits and focused on her recovery. She is hugely grateful to the medical team for the care they are providing to her, a spokesman said. She now needs time, space, and privacy to complete her treatment and make a full recovery.